what the fuck are you waiting for? It's time for you to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up. Hit that notification bell. It will inform you of my next video. Hola. Y bienvenido a in Your Lipstick. El pinta labio que tengo puesto para este video is by Pat McGrath y se llama Elsa number three. My luxury wish list for 2021. Yeah! I love making this type of video because this is the type of video where I get to dream pretty much and salivate and drool over all the things that when I'm rich, I will be able to get my hands on. I am manifesting that for this year. Some of these I might be lucky enough to maybe get. Some of them is, is a definite not, but it will serve as an inspiration because thank God for dupes. So let me show you what's on my luxury radar for 2021 because we're dreaming big. Hit it, bitches! Number one. Okay, this first one is from a couple of seasons ago, but I don't really care. I don't care. Look at this shirt by, I'm not sure if you pronounce this as Kite or Kate, but just look at this top. It's called the Maddie Top. Look how gorgeous this is. I've been seeing this for a couple of seasons, and ever since I laid my hazel peepers on these things, I was obsessed. I want to get them so bad, it's not even funny. And I feel like ever since I first saw them, I keep seeing them come back with new colors. I mean, like if the abuse is not already there, I will buy the shit in like every color that they have. I don't know. Something about the bust line, the cut of the shirt on the bottom is uber sexy, uber modern. I mean, this shit just looks so futuristic. You wear this with some like fitted pants, trousers, denim, it doesn't freaking matter and it would look immaculate. I just love this shirt. It just never left my mind, but this sucker costs $1,080 and something as popular as this will never go on sale. I haven't seen it on sale. And even if I see it on sale, it will never get to the point where it will be comfortable. But I'm manifesting my damn dream for 2021 between my health and becoming rich. I will get all four. I'm not even gonna torture myself trying to figure out which one to get. Call me Crazy Daisy. I've heard it before. Numero dos. These Mew Mew leather studded boots are from a few seasons back, but they're on sale right now. Ever since I laid my eyes on these, I knew I wanted to get them. They're so relevant right now with the motorcycle boot, but I don't have anything like this that has spikes on them. I love the punk look, the goth look, the dark look, the moody look, whatever you want to call it, grunge look. I want these so bad. I asked my husband and he's like, no. You know what I'm saying? I've seen them on sale for 427. And yes, it's a lot, but it's Mew Mew and it normally costs over the freaking thousands. I'm not even in a place to be spending $400, but I do make extraordinary exceptions and when i say extraordinary <laughs> exceptions is that i jump hoops to get my hands on these things i will save for a lifetime if it gets me these boots these are on my freaking radar i want them so bad <sighs> number three the mark jacob snapshot camera bag and flat they're the most accessible if you will i use that word in the loosest sense because that's all relative and objective, right? I mean, to each his own. I want this one. Is it bad that I want this one too? These are the new ones. These are the black ones. They have like that glittery leather look, super shiny. I want it. This was on my wish list for my husband during the holidays, but it was sold out, so he wasn't able to get his hands on it. But they're back. Fully locked and reloaded for my paws to nap. I want the gold one. I mean, I would actually buy them all, but that's not greedy daisy. I don't have anything gold-ish. This one is for $3.95. It's more expensive than the ones that I have because I normally grab them on sale for $2.95. I love it. Help! Numero cuatro. Bottega Veneta. At this point, I should just sleep with whoever Bottega Veneta is. And I don't really care what sex they are because the fact of the matter is this brand has so many beautiful things I just can't. I just can't deal with myself. This is one of it. I have to narrow the crap down. I want this. The leather cuff bracelet. And it comes in a range of candy 
colors and they're so irresistible. I will eat them one by one if I could. This sucker costs $620. $620 for a bracelet? Yeah. That's not what we're sending out to the universe. It will be in my hands this coming year for 2021. It's on my luxury wish list. I'm sending it out there to the universe. I don't even know what color I will get. I just want one of each to be quite honest with you. Bottom line is I would buy one in every color that I can find and wear these 365 days a year. Sink. The V logo reversible leather belt by Valentino Garavani my brother from another mother. I don't know, something about it. You know, again, like I've said it before, I'm not a person that's into logo, but something about this, it's just taking me straight to like South Beach, New York City, some posh Paris City. I'm having a martini, it's an uber sexy lounge, and I'm just having the time of my life type of vibe. I can see myself wearing this on a beach party with like a little flowy dress and then just wrap this around and my hair nice and flowy and just soft and feminine but like sexy and sultry by the black first because it's my favorite and then because of course I love it I have to get two I will get the pink one I love it.